Hello, my name is Pixelated Twix, and welcome back to Boundless. Okay, so I was doing some shopping, and I came to the store. I've been to the store a few times, and this actually was one of my favorite stores when I started playing Boundless, because I thought it was beautiful, and it is still very beautiful. But... Um, what caught my eye was this portal here to Valhalla as a sovereign world. And of course, I'm nosy. Okay, anytime I see an open portal somewhere random to a sovereign world, I want to go see what's going on. So I decided to step through and let me tell you wow. Now, I didn't get far, I just went far enough to see like a, one thing and I walked back out because I felt like this would be perfect to record for a hidden gems video and it will be my first like hidden gems video on a sovereign world yeah okay so we're gonna go in let me tell you something hold on to your butts okay just saying so we're gonna head into this portal and this is the hub this is where i first stepped in now i think i don't know i'm assuming just from the color palette and the style this belongs to the person who owns uh, Falling Gardens. Um, I love the color scheme. Now, purple is a really gorgeous color. Um, not my favorite color, but it is so pretty. And I love how um, they did the foliage. It looks like grapevines. I absolutely adore this. So, this is their guild hub and their player. Homes. Okay, so I'm really curious about these two, but we don't have that kind of time. Maybe I'll come back and check this out later. But um, yeah, look at this portal hub. It's so pretty. Okay, so they have a mall. I'm curious. <gasps> Ooh, oh my gosh. Look how pretty this is. Oh, so you can get through here. Okay. Oh, wow. That's a good idea. Lily pads. Okay, I have to I have to steal this. I'm definitely stealing that. This is gorgeous. Oh my gosh. Love the stores. Very cool. Looks like the Galleria. Mm. Oh, Flea markets. I do love a good flea market, guys. Okay, so, ooh, um, PD. I love the purple PD. I might have to use some of that in a build in Purple Rain District because, you know, purple and everything. Gotta have that. I almost went through the wrong door. These, This is glass, right? No, yeah, it is. Okay. Uh, save myself from embarrassment. Is this glass too? Okay. Because this looks dangerous. Like, I mean, am I exposed? Am I exposed? I just want to know. Am I exposed? Am I? Nope. Okay, I'm safe. <laughs> Some of you guys be tripping with the glass and, and exposures. Yeah, okay. Oh, is this? This isn't white. That's probably like some... Okay, that's, that's probably like weary mustard or something. Okay, let's head out. Can we go back? Oh, we'll have to go back this way. I love the mall. I love the use of the gleam. Okay, let me just give you guys a simple tip on building with gleam. Less is more. Um, <laughs> uh, I'm not so professional. Believe me, you've seen my builds. I'm definitely not professional. But less is definitely more. And in this case, they've done a banner job. First of all, you already you already have me at hello because you have white marble and white concrete. I, I think this is white marble. I could be wrong. Where's my Where's my thing? That's cool gray. Okay, I'm sorry. And what is this? Cool berry. You know what? I'm not judging you. I love the cool berry too. Let's let's be honest. I love cool berry just as much as I love white. But this looks like this might be white. That is also a cool berry. Cool berry is known as the poor man's white. Oh wow. Okay. This is where I this is where I walked out. And this is what I saw first. <laughs> that. I did not see that, but this, look at this. Let's just admire 
the foundation, the base of this. Look at this. I really love the detailing. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to slap your whatever. I, I did mean, what was I saying? I'm, I'm so in awe that I don't know what I'm saying right now. I love how the um, use of rift and the marble and the mosaic and the concrete and the, the dirt and the foliage all comes together to make this base. It's fabulous. Okay, let's just get a gander of the, the hub. My hubs look like boxes. This looks like a Taj Mahal. It's fantastic. And this, oh my gosh. See, I love this effect. I've been trying to do this and what? Okay, let me take this in. I'm a little overwhelmed right now as per usual, but look at this statue. Look at this statue, guys. This is crazy. Okay, I have to get a closer look. This is an expensive build. Oh my gosh. Sorry. Minecraft could not. Minecraft could, but it wouldn't look like this. Oh my gosh. What in the world? Oh my goodness. Look at this. Gleam, okay, when I said gleam, less is more. This works fabulously, fabulously, fabulously. Take it all in, guys. Now, there's not a ton in this area to see. Oh, I do love the purple and the, um, the cold berry theme here. So pretty. Okay, so this is your workshop. I'm just curious. Obviously, we're going in. Okay, we can't go in. How can we go in? I like it. This is really cool. This is a really cool way to hide um, your machines. I love how people are so... Whoa. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. One thing at a time. That is storage. That is storage. Okay, let me just say this. Right now, I could never... This is so, so good. So good. Let me, let me get this, let me get this out of the way. This is distracting, all of this. All of this is distracting. We need to see everything without the distractions. This looks so good. Again, with the purple and coldberry theme, it works really well together. I love how people have this monochrome tones, not like um, all over the place. I have to say I appreciate it. It makes me want to go and rebuild a good portion of my, um, my little area. I almost want to just go ahead and rebuild my storage area too definitely like what's here in the middle it's just it's mind-blowing how people think outside of the box literally outside of the box because mine look like boxes but there's so much detail in the chiseling and the columns and I love how the the marble wraps around the columns and makes these little coves these little boxy areas for storage what's back here is there anything Okay, so this is more machine work. Looks like, um, let's out go out here really quick. Okay, so this is another portion of the storage area. Quite massive. Mine is tiny compared to this. I'm gonna compare other people's builds to mine because that's all I'm going off of right now. Um, oh my gosh. I don't know who built this. I don't know who. Um, the Vikings in her gate. I'm not sure who. Oh, wow. Do you guys see this? So, if you know anything about Norse mythology, Valhalla is the place that uh, Vikings go when they die. It's their form of heaven. Um, oh, wow. Is this Colberry sand? 
wait, where's my thing? See, this is what happens when I, <laughs> look at this. It's Weary Violet. Huh. I actually like this. Simple, but still it looks, it works. Who would have thunk to you Sam like this? Man, this is, there's so much. Okay, let's go up here. I really want to get a closer look at this fountain. Oh my gosh, look at this gazebo. I'm being followed. They're probably like, who is this? It is I. Check this out. You can even hear the water. Oh my gosh. What? Okay. Let's go in here. I have no shame. I'm looking at your stuff. No shame at all. Razor's workshop. Razor. Razor. I like it a lot. <laughs> okay. Razor. Let's discuss. You really have to like purple and white. Or purple, well, white. I, but I'm going to say white. To, to live here, and I, I could, I could live here. I could also live with the Reapers. I could also live on Horches. So, I mean, I have no um, prejudices when it comes to where I could live, because these people know how to build and obviously enjoy it, obviously um, take time and, oh, okay, let's not kill ourselves. Let's not do that. Let's, let's get something to eat. <laughs> Let us not do that. We've already killed ourselves once a day, once twice a day, trying to do the Reaper trials. I don't want to talk about it. I don't. Okay. Um. Yeah, Razor. I really like your workshop. It's gorgeous. I love how it's built into this tunnel. Totally something I would do. Um. I love underground builds. They're my favorites. Okay. Um. You know we're just gonna keep this grapple on. What's over here? Look at these columns. I mean, there's something different. The columns are all different, but they all fit. Like, there's something simple as just straight up concrete like this. Very little chiseling, but it works, right? I love this right here. Then you come down here and you have the intricate chiseling here. Still works, totally different from that one but still works. Like, if I were to imagine Valhalla in my head, it certainly didn't look like this, but I could see it looking like this. I love the lights. Look at that. Beautiful. The trees. Hmm. This actually might work in something that I'm doing. So I have, I'm struggling with my trees lately. Um, not that I, ooh, I like how they did these. Gorgeous. Okay. So this is like, what is this? Observatory. Did we come out of here? Is this where we came out of? Curious. This is their exos. Okay. 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 So no, we didn't come out of here. So this is like their, okay, this is like a little flea market. This is another workshop. You guys are a lot of workshops. Is this some specific workshop? Please repair as needed. I like it. I also have a guild workshop, but we also have a guild workshop. Um, I'm working in that, a uh, second portion of it. But kind of wish I had done it like this, where it's like separate rooms like this. I love that. I did come across um, a build a long time ago where there was a guild who created separate buildings for each machine. And what contest is this? You know we're going to have to come back and look at this, the contest. I'm just curious. I'm just going to step through really quick and look at what's going on here. What is this? Welcome to Portal Seekers Viking. Oh, this was a Chris. Ooh, how did I miss this? Obviously, because I didn't. Oh, this is cute. Okay, let's go back out. Let's go back out. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is the guild house. Oh man, this looks so good. 
Wow. So the Vikings Guild, I think I've seen them around. I think I have, I'm not sure though. Um, I obviously saw one person over there. They're probably still wondering what the heck I'm doing over here. Don't worry. This is their guild buffs. Be nice to all. So pretty. This is definitely one of those builds where pretty and beautiful work. Okay, now the Reapers, yo, that was amazing. Okay, this is amazing too, but the color scheme, look at this, look at, okay, see that building we, we looked at when we first stepped out? Look at it from afar, look at that. That's freaking awesome. Um, we're definitely going to check that out now. I'm, I'm curious about this though. I want to see where this goes. I feel like they're still building out here. I do love the tunnel. Yeah, I, this looks like they might be still building. Or is this just another part that is finished? I don't know. We shall see. Okay, they're still building out this way. But um, I have high hopes. There's a lot over here. There's still stuff over here. Okay. We'll get back to the other building. I just want to see what's over here. This looks like um, this might be someone's personal area that's kind of offset from the rest. Um, let's check it out. Let's check it out. What's going on over here? Looks like they're working on something. Oh, okay. This isn't done. This isn't done. Let's go back. Let's go back. Um, yeah, no, okay. They're still working on it. Gotcha. Like I said, I really love the theme of this this planet. I want to do something like this, but I realize other people farm on my planet, so I'm kind of I can't, I'm kind of um, leery about making something so. I want to say girly. I know guys can can like pink and purple. But let's just be honest, this is extremely, like the colors of, but also purple is the color of royalty. So we could say that too. We really could. I mean, Prince, come on. He was music royalty. Okay. Um, but this is something that definitely Prince would hang out in. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm absolutely in awe by this planet. Um, just the colors. And of course, your builds here um, make this planet even more special. Now, if you guys didn't know, the Reapers also have their own planet, and I did get to visit it. Um, yeah, let's say that they continued the um, the craziness on that sovereign planet. So uh, maybe one of these days I'll get to um, film that. MB, um, one of my buddies from the guild, showed me and I don't remember where it's at, so I definitely have to have her show me where that was. Again, I didn't say the location, but I would definitely like to um, show you guys that lo that locale. Um, oh, we've got a different theme going on over here. Uh, what? I don't know what uh, tier this planet is. I haven't seen any meteors, so I'm thinking we're on like a tier two or something like that. Let's check this out. I do love the red. It's com okay. I lied. There's a meteor. Um, I like the red. It, it's uh, it's so different from the rest of the um, build. It's almost like um, this person is rebelling against the guild. I'm like, no, I'm going with the red theme. Thank you. Thank you very much. Red and Night Azure. I can appreciate a good Night Azure. I love Night Azure, by the way. Who's this? I want to know. Who is the uh, the rebel here? I want to know who the rebel is. I like your build. Okay. Um, how, how did I come in through here? Was it this? This was not it. This definitely was not it. This has to be it here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and it's lava. Yeah, this person is definitely definitely rebelling because they've got more lava down here is that bitch oh, is this them too i don't know i don't know 
this looks like this might be them too. Yeah, this person's rebelling. How do you go from something that looks so, so peaceful and heavenly to something that looks like it belongs, not necessarily hell, because it's too pretty, but the red color gives me that theme, that, that feeling. Oh, and the jack-o'-lanterns. Yep, the, and the spiders. Definitely hellish. Spiders are involved. It's hellish. Still like, oh, is that a big... That looks nasty. That looks nasty. Oh my gosh. Why are there spiders in this game? They're fake spiders. I know. I realize this, guys. I realize this now. But they are disgusting. Can, can we agree? Ooh, I love the boat. But can we agree on that? The spiders are gross. When we first started playing, we thought Cosmic Mermaid and Brit, Miss Brit Gaming, we thought the spiders meant that their sales area was empty. We didn't realize, oh gosh, I'm talking and not paying attention. We did not realize that uh, these were decorative items and people were voluntarily putting these up. I love them, what, okay? I'm just getting a, no, I fell, actually. I was I was gonna play this, I was like, I'm just getting a good view of this building. No, I fell, I fell. Ooh, this looks like it's moving. Clever. Clever, love the bridge. All right, let's see if we can get back up on this bad boy. Okay, and this is why I can't do the Reaper Trials. Again, I don't want to talk about it. Um, what is this over here? I think this is where we came in. Oh, I love this. Yeah, this is someone's, um, no. This is different. This is someone else's place. We're gonna go in. Oh my gosh, all the diamonds. You people are rich, okay? <laughs> you people are rich. Look at all the rift and, and the ort. Still working? Yep, yeah, still working. Ooh. I like it. See how people hide their machine um, connectors? The, the sparklings, I think they're called. I actually did some, uh, some rewiring myself because I was inspired by uh, Reaper's build and I ended up doing a whole lot of rewiring. And I have to say, I like it a lot better. It looks a lot cleaner. It's like when you know you're working. Oh, I can't go through here. Okay. Interaction not allowed. Came through this way. Okay. Sorry. What's down here? Ooh. Oh. What do we have? This works. I mean, all of it does. Okay, people are still building. I, I have to say, you guys, I'm impressed. There, I have not not been impressed so far. Not that I could say that I. Never mind. Oh my gosh. Love it. Now, over here, this is the granddaddy or grandmama. Did I, I don't even know if I've seen everything. I mean, this is cool, but this, is this a collective build? Did, did all of you guys build this or did one person do this? If one person did this, I applaud you. I mean, if multiple people do it, did it, I applaud you as well, but the feat of strength it took to chisel all of this out. And it's symmetrical. I would have screwed this up. This is freaking gorgeous. Hunt World Community Planet 
book with Isabelle or am also you can book here hunt region 64 hunt regions there's 64 of them all flat beautiful here for everyone to enjoy just book your hunt that's actually a cool because let me tell you something guys I love hunting but I don't necessarily love grappling through big crevices and mountainous ranges I don't mind a flat hunt so they do have oh this is clever oh my gosh this is really clever Take no guilds. This is, I'm taking out. I don't even have a guild. I'm in a guild, but I don't have one. Take note though. Heal your, heal your friends. What is this? What's going on in here? More storage? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm so overwhelmed right now. I, oh my gosh, look at these columns. Look at these columns. Wow. Look in between. The detailing in between. Look at this door. Boundless community. Okay, I don't know. <laughs> you want to know one reason why you should play Boundless? This right here. Because you can do this. If you're a builder, and even if you want to be a builder, this is why you should play Boundless. One of the reasons why. Because you can do stuff like this. Chisels are amazing. And yes, they do mod in, in other games. Uh, my chisels in or some of them actually do but have the chisels but come on they don't have the blocks like this and some people are turned off by the realistic um, voxel uh, graphics but I'm not I have no complaints I actually do like a more realistic game oh you guys had a diamond right there look at that right there see right there right there Oh, this is fantastic, fan-freaking-tastic. Wow, okay, wow. I've been here for a long time, longer than I thought I would be, and um, I still haven't seen everything. This is obviously eye candy, come visit this this the sovereign planet you saw where it's at you have to hit up dk mall and come into the falling gardens store and head into the portal that says valhalla easy to find as a matter of fact um who has pets do y'all have pets i don't know what tier this is don't know um I'm, I think I'm safe now. I'm not sure. I'm not prepared. I'm not prepared. But yeah, definitely come see this for yourself. Um, I will try to remember to um, link the... Well, not link, but um, give you the directions to the store, to Fall Garden, so you can find the portal. Also, you can find the portal through Easy... I think it's Easy Peasy's um, hub area and then TNT. So if you can't find it through DK Mall, definitely check out those portal areas um, or those areas and you should be able to find it perfectly fine. Um, yeah, so I uh, am so grateful that <laughs> I was able to walk through here and see this um, fabulously built. Oh, I see, I didn't even get to go in there. But like I said, so much to see. And it doesn't really take up a whole lot of square footage. Um, I guess this is probably what your average settlement looks like right now. Um, but yeah, this is, I don't, I, I have no words. Um, my mind is blown once again, and um, I have no complaints here. I'm definitely looking forward to seeing more of what you guys can do 
um, it is definitely inspiring for me um, as someone who is um, a slightly average, I'm not even gonna say average, I'm slightly average at building. This is mind blowing and you guys have really knocked my socks off. So wow, kudos to you uh, Vikings Guild and everyone else that I have visited. You guys are fabulously talented and um, I'm jealous. Anyways, I do thank you guys for hanging out with me for another Hidden Gems episode. And I do hope that um, I can find more places like this on Boundless. I'm sure there's plenty, um, but sometimes I just don't know where to go and I happen to fall across this and um, we go from there. So drop your comments below how you what you thought about this build um, if you plan on visiting and if there's a planet that you want me to visit or a town that you want me to visit let me know in the comments that would be greatly appreciated the feedback um, is needed required yes it's a prerequisite all right guys thank you for watching my name is pixelated twix she is luna shale ciao